Welcome to our Cypress Automation Testing Scenario Talks. Today we will talk about Cypress API Testing Use Cypress Request Function. Cypress supports API testing use Cypress Request Function. It allow get post, port, delete operations. You can validate status codes, responsible body, headers, and eventual requests. Cypress API Testing Overview Cypress can test APIs without interacting with the UI, improve test speed, and isolating logical from interface issues. Steps First step, set up, test with describe and it blocks. Second, use separate request. Third, validate code, the status code body and uh, headers. Force chair course if needed. Sep separate API testing code example. Here is the get func uh, get method. Separate request use get. This is a basic URL. Get the response. Then check the status code equal 200 and the check respond body have array and log out the body content use the JSON straight file. Another example is the post request post method. Post gave the title and the complete for. You see here the check post code status code equal 201 and also check the response body have the title test test another method we we see the port first we post a new task then use power Port update the task. So check the code is 200. Also, response body is com completed equal true. Delete function. First, use request post a new tab task. Then use the delete function method and delete this post task and check the code equal 200. Okay, let's look at the codes. Here you see is a description block gives the name and the function. Here is a constant base URL. This is a local host. And here is a it block and a this is for the test it lane. We test get. And here is how to use a separate request. This is the user method for operation get. This is a base URL. And then response. Response and check response status equal 200. And uh, response body have the array and use this JSON string file change uh, convert the body to the JSON not notation. Here is a check if the body less more than zero and expect the body have the property ID and also property title and property complete. So this is a test get. Let me run 
And、uh, this is、uh, I start the local host for this uh, uh, application for the testing. So this is a portal five thousand. And、uh, I run this one. You can see here is a、uh, call and get something for this、uh, local host. You can check this one. Yeah, because we use the、uh, API tester now you are、uh, now use interface, so you can here you see is access code is two hundred and also array have the sixty. Object and、uh, expect the, have the ID, have the title and the complaint, and uh, load uh, log log separate log and、uh, we use the JSON straight file and、uh, give the, all of the value into the JSON notations. You see here is、uh, all of the data in in the database and.、Uh, From the get API and get all of the data. And here is another method. This. Another method we call the post. So this is eat lame lame the test lame and the request. This is a post method and use base URL and what you post title is a test task and the complete is a full. And you see after post expected. Code state code is a two hundred one, and also for the response body have the title is a test task and uh, uh, separate uh, log the this body value. So let me run it. You say here is a post method is post code is two hundred one yeah it equal two hundred one and also property have the title and also you see here is like property have the title and company the equal false and here is the get the database what we post here you say here is a post ID and the title and the And the time and the complete force and the update at the time. Another method is port. Port is update task. Before the post, we have the task and use the port and update this task. So use the method post and. Base URL and、uh, you see here is、uh, title is a task to update, and、uh, this is respond body, and the respond body we have like the ID and log the ID and also you see here is a complete and expected the code is two hundred and also the body have the complete equal true. And、uh, log the this body. Let let me run this one.
you say here is a post uh, and uh, you, you say is a like a porter first step is a post and then is a up, update the post uh, task to here you say here is a code is equal 200 and uh, this is a true yeah because before the post we complete is a false and update is a 10 to the true so uh, log the, this uh, post uh, update the data so you see here is uh, uh, this object what include in this object the value and uh, if you see here you you see the this is a one the here you see all of the like update inside insert is a database task you see here is a value is here and then is update so update is set this equal this one and uh, then get you can get all of the information you see here is complete and the task is a change Another method we call the delete. Delete. Delete is a, delete a task in a database. Uh, use the request delete. You see here. Uh, for the test, first we post, we post one of the task and then we use the delete and delete this task. We check the task is not in the database okay i run it you see here is a method is a delete delete is a first is a post get a task in a database and then i log log the uh, task id so id is here and log all of the task create information here and then use the request delete method the return the 200 and delete what delete task id is 24 so access the code is equal 200 and log this one you see here method is task delete you can see here yeah like you you say delete task where id is 24. so today we are just simply uh, introduce the separate request method how to api test one is get post port delete thank you for your watching our video hope you like it if you want to follow our updates, please subscribe. See you next time.